right, got some Red Dead Redemption. Um, this is the multiplayer. I think it's like Team Death. Oh, no, no, no. This is like Grab Bag, which is the equivalent to... Uh, what is it the equivalent to? It's like the equivalent to Capture the Flag in most shooters. So you just kind of run it. There's like a bag on each side of the map that you have to go and grab from each other. And you... Uh, just kill each other and then try and grab the other person's bag or something. I don't know. Whatever. It's just ca I'm just gonna call it capture the flag because I don't really have any other name for it. But uh, right here in the beginning, there is the shootout, which starts every match. I think I'm not sure if it's every match, but it's pretty much every match. And there's me, my ugly. Look at that. The guy is just ugly. I don't know what they were. Whatever. And this is the beginning. I think I actually we win this one, but this guy, the guy I'm facing, isn't even playing. So, it doesn't really matter, but, um, so far, I think this multiplayer is really fun and definitely adds a lot to the game. I mean, considering you can do co-op missions and things like that over Xbox Live, kind of like Borderlands, except, like, ten times better, considering it's a huge world and it's open and you don't have to, like, load different locations on the map. So here I start off, and I'm kind of rushing. Not really rushing, but like, you know, I'm just r running over to their spawn as fast as I can, which you can't really run that fast in this game, because, well, you, I guess you can, just not really that fast. But, um, you know, just running right over their spawn. You know, I've never tried is running way out there and see what happens when it runs way out there. Let's see. Oh, my friend's playing some Call of Duty over here. Let's see what he did for the game-winning kill. He's telling me to look. Looks like a throwing knife. Oh, wow. Like a... Holy shit, dude, <laughs> he just spun like... <laughs> Alright, he just spun, there's a guy who was not paying attention, and he at least spun at least five, six times around, and just knifed him on like 10 sensitivity, it was pretty cool. But, kind of embarrassing for the guy who's not playing, so, uh, right? I don't know if it just happened, or what? Yeah, it might have just happened, I pulled out my double barrel shotgun and killed that guy. It's the first time I've ever used that gun, I've never really tried it, I've just pretty much kept the rifle and the pistol because I find those two to be the most easy to kill people with. Considering the rifle's a two-shot kill, and the pistol is... I don't know how many, but I just keep pulling the trigger. Nice that you can... If you haven't... If you altered the aiming system on this, you want to keep it on, like, normal, or whatever it is, that where you can just lock on. You just keep tapping the left trigger, and it just locks on. Because if you put it to expert, then you can't lock on. You have to, like aim the reticle everywhere you want it to go and you don't and you can't just lock on you'll have a big dis big disadvantage on against everybody else unless you get high enough rank where you reach the expert shooting thing where everybody has to do that then it makes it more fair but um i'm i'm having fun with this game but i want to know what you guys want to see because i've been you know uploading this is the second Red Dead Redemption thing. This one's multiplayer, which I think is better. Here I almost die, and I shoot around at this box, and that thing saves me. And if you guys didn't know, hit right button when you're near any kind of cover, and you'll, like, dive or roll over into that into cover. As I do right here and right there, which pretty much saved me. But, um, so, if you tell me what you guys want to see, because I don't know what you guys want to see, so you guys gotta tell me. You want to see Call of Duty? You want to see Red Dead? You want to see Halo? You what do you want? Multiplayer Red Dead offline? I don't I don't know. I don't know. You tell me. And uh, if you don't know how to contact me, either comment and I'll read all the comments, or you can go to my page, my YouTube, and it'll be in the link in the description. And um, send me a message or something like that and also what I'd like to start doing is like um, if you guys wanna like come play with me or wanna do something on YouTube and have me capture something and we can do some cool stuff like that uh, add me or don't add me cause I probably won't accept it because my friend list is already pretty much full but um, you can send me a message or invite me to a party or something like that cause I'm I might, I probably, well, I don't know. You just send me a message, and I'll get back to you on Xbox Live. Or you can add my sec, add me on my second account, which is called The Rotting Pair. No spaces at all. I'll put both my main, main account, no worries, and The Rotting Pair in the description so you guys know how to spell it and everything. So if you guys want to contact me on Xbox Live, and we can hook up or whatever, play some games on, on whatever you want to play. And, uh, you can... Yeah, play with us.
if you want. But, uh, yeah. So, this game I don't really know any tactics for. Sorry, I just blew into the mic. Oh, bad. Complete accident. This mic is really cheap and hard to use and not very hard. It's very easy to blow into the mic and make it a loud buzzing noise. But, um... <clears throat> This game, uh, yeah, I, I don't really have any tactics considering I just got it, and and I just started playing it, and, and the multiplayer, anyways. But the uh, on the uh, the other, what is it? Um, not multiplayer, but the offline or whatever. I've played that quite a bit. I'm almost done. I think. I think I'm almost done. I hope I'm almost done. I'm, I, it seems like I'm pretty far, but. Um, it's long. It takes a while. It's nice because I hate games where it takes like two min, like six hours of gameplay, and you've beat the game, which is kind of stupid in my opinion. Why would you even make a six-hour game? But uh, it's it takes a while. It take and plus all the side missions, and then after you beat it, you can enter cheats and mess mess around. It's pretty fun. I have yet to do any of the like missions co-op because it seems like none of my friends that I like to play with are uh, even like even play this game oh wow you just got <laughs> my friend's playing call of duty and he just got killed by a guy in last stand who had an rpg out like what the hell <laughs> whatever um but yeah um i can't remember what i was talking about i completely lost my train of thought anyway so oh, i think i just got headshotted there wow I died like in one shot so obviously but yeah the headshots in this game that's instant kill two to the body with a rifle I don't know anyway I've already said this um I think the game's about to come to an end here we're about to win because I capped at least one I think I capped one maybe two I can't remember but here I'm trying to get up on the wall cattle rustlers win because apparently we're the cattle rustlers and I start shooting in joy but it does this cool little like outro thing where it shows the top player and stuff like that and then I get some EXP and whatnot match bonus which is kinda like Call of Duty in my opinion but that's the top player spinning his pistol uh, thanks for watching guys comment rate subscribe come check out my channel message me tell me what you want you can contact me on Xbox Live thanks for watching back to the